fica mais uma reserva de gás natural na bacia do Rovuma. O primeiro navio de gás natural livre feito de África. Com reservas potenciais de mais de 7 trilhões de pés cúbicos. O ano construída ela é... An impressive set of natural gas discoveries between 2010 and 2014 confirmed the Ravuma Basin in the offshore of northern Mozambique as a world-class natural gas province. The results exceeded expectations, about 85 trillion cubic feet of gas in place. Of the different reservoirs discovered, coral will be the first gas field to be put in production, allowing Mozambique to benefit from its resources and triggering further development opportunities. ENI, its partners and stakeholders, agreed that production from coral would be achieved through a record-breaking floating, liquefied, natural gas facility, the Coral Soul FLNG. That was the beginning of a dream that today becomes reality. Coral Sol F LNG will be the world's first floating LNG project in ultra deep waters and the first LNG project in Mozambique. The Coral Sol F LNG is 432 meters long, 66 meters wide, and weighs some 220,000 tons able to accommodate up to 350 people. The facility has been designed with the latest LNG technology, applied in an offshore environment, with a strong focus on energy efficiency and the reduction of greenhouse gases emissions. Coral South is a unique opportunity to trigger the country's economic development while delivering a reliable source of energy. The journey has been remarkable. Just over three years from the first steel cut to sail away. This was possible thanks to a phased approach, in which different teams worked in parallel across the world. An effective partnership between all the companies involved allowed the management of the supply chain and the work from seven different operating centers in four continents involving around 6,000 workers at its peak. Coral South achieved all its milestones on time, despite the unprecedented pandemic challenges over the past years. The Coral South project will provide revenues and employment opportunities in Mozambique and gas to global markets. Several initiatives are taking place to boost local content and maximize Mozambican participation. Almost 1,000 Mozambicans have already been trained, including 149 young engineers that have gained highly qualified training abroad on the first phase, and 55 currently under training contributing to the successful development of the project while preparing to work on the Coral Sol F LNG. 
Bringing this dream to reality required skills, experience and partnerships. The success of this project is testament to the quality of the asset and to Eni's technological leadership in the development of deep water gas fields. Coral Sul FLNG, a symbol of engineering excellence. Eni and its partners, ExxonMobil, CNPC, GALP, COGAS and ENH are committed to producing the first LNG in Mozambique in 2022, paving the way for a deep transformation of the country towards a sustainable, long-term development. <laughs>